A mantra is a soothing sonic reverberation through the throat, but it has no meaning, no significance. It's just the empty, gibbertical sound of soul serenity, vibrations devoid of implicatorial importance. There's no issues. Don't look for meaning because there is none, okay? Meditation just calms me down. I alone stride along to strive alone to unify all men in the greasy heat of my unifryer. No! Back away from the boy! Uncloven his hoof! This abuse will not stand down! You can't pope with his pooper, Fadre! I don't know what you're saying. I'll get to your bottom of this. Show me on me what the bad man did to you. Did he make you go down on your knees for him? Only when he played with me. Sounds like you were his prey. Where'd you come across this child? My affairs? Ooh, nice. This is a poor orphan boy from the parish. They say he was a virgin birth. But every boy needs love. Well, I never got any, and I think I turned out okay. Ah. Here, wear this priest-proof chastity diaper so he can't catholic you no more. Well, I don't like what you're insinuating. That thing is scaring me. Okay, your wholeness. Let me smell your fingers. Now you smell mine, kid. You smell his nose while I check him for lies. Well, well that's it. Forgive me, Father, as I make this poor soul take that. Sweet Mother Mary, shut your virgin eyes I force this arse to taste the pain. You are forgiven, my child. Come on, Seamus. Hail Mary full of gaze. Will I say you're in? In my gaze. If you so much as think about touching that boy again, I'll so much as think about doing something about it. You did a good job keeping our secret. Just don't ever tell nobody about what I do to you. Or I cut your parts off and feed them to my teddy bear, Mr. Ruffle. Okay, just don't do those things to me bad place anymore. I'll do what I want. Got it? Yes, Seamus. This happy place holds magic meaning for my mother's nickname. Truckers, delivery guys, men coming in and out of the house all day called her the Grand Canyon, but I never knew why. It's just a great wide gash spread open for the enjoyment of all to come inside as he pleases and pleasures. Often there's a donkey in there. He, huh? Huh? Don't fear. Help is on the right here. No, no, no help needed. We're fine, right, honey? Have another one, honey. Just enjoying this beautiful... Beautiful weather, laying flowers where our son was killed. And I suppose you blame yourselves for his death. I know I do. We've just been a little depressed since he died. I don't know what it is. I am a raging hellfire of roiling misery. That's what these pink ones are for. A dead child is like pudding. The proof is in the fact that he probably looked like pudding when he got hit by that car. And I think it's time you be putting his chocolate memory to rest. Rest? Oh, have one of the green ones. They'll help you rest. You want the rest? Huh? No, I don't believe in pills. There's a pill for that, too. Here. My parakeet feeds her babies every day. How come I don't get no din-din? Mommy loves only her pills. They stop my quivers. Thanks, Mommy. Pills are just pills, a psychotropic pills. bond aid on a biochemical crutch. I took a pill once, and I woke up with a booty hole the size of a wine bottle. Fat end first. But did I whine? No. I turned to the bottle. And when I woke up from that, I met up with you fine folks to warn you about pills. Just pills. walk it off. Your pills. child is dead, and you could never, ever replace never. him. That's never. it. I can replace him. You can? By the end of the day, you will have forgotten all about your dead turtle. I mean, son. <gasps> See? They've got this poor child pulling a train. It's time to cease the skeet and diddling and skedaddle and get you a new mommy and daddy. Fresh meat. Look at this den of iniquity. Even the Bibles are ribbed. But for whose pleasure? They even have a sex swing set. And whoopee crayons just need to black you up. Flash colored. How offensive. Oh, shiftless. This ought to get you black on track. Black, black. This is Shaka Dingo. He looks just like our Michael right after he got hit by that car. Shaquan Dingo, go hug your new mommy and daddy. We're not ready for this. I, I can't. can't. Just... Oh, can't pick you up, dear. Mommy's holding some raw meat. <laughs> <laughs> mommy can't kiss your boo-boo. Still holding that raw meat from years ago. Meat. Close your legs, Mother. You're embarrassing me. I'll make you all vibe together using ancient Hopi tribe procedure rituals that will fashion family bondage. Ooh. Ooh. We're recreating the psychogenetic birthular attachment. Push, push. But I can't push him out. He's not in. I think I know what I'm doing. Pull, pull. I confuse. You've got black.
black gobs of family holidays to make up for four Kwanzas, three Kwanzaa weens, and a queefster to quetch up on. Queer, bite the Kwanzaa bean. This isn't a real Kwanzaa bean. As your grinds intertwines the commingling fluid, family eyes advises you. You are now one. Do you have any mouthwash? Your breath stinks. And the last step, to pick up where you left off with Michael so that Chaka Dingo can fill the place in your black heart that Michael so rudely interrupted. Yes, snatch him, throw the clutches when your prior son was fell dead. And yes, I glued his shoes to the road to cement a seal on the deal. And yes, I tied his belt twixt two trees for kids. Oh, I never want to lose you again. Son. Frutata. Family. Achieved. You're psycholegally adopted. Where's that over there? A candy dolphin? Ooh, candy dolphin? Where is it? Maybe if I look real hard. I'm gonna do bad things to you tonight and make you suffer for my place. <gasps> what? I see what's going on. You're trying to distract me to keep me from seeing a sweet land dolphin. There's something fishy about you, too. As this child's weenie minder, I am policing you now, and I'll cop you later if you so much as yodel his scrotal or fiddle his faddle. I have reason to believe this kid's lower back bottom was once treated like Grand Central Station, and I got four tickets to the opera. We'll get there by train. Up his... <laughs> If you say anything, you gonna wake up with your face in my tummy, cause I ate it. What were you two doing in the bathroom during intermission? We were just talking. Eating ice cream? I mean, talking about ice cream that we were just eating. What? But were you doing in there earlier? I was being raped by flavor. He just shoved the cone right in me. Last night, he gave me a banana split, and it hurt. I can't take it anymore. Open your mouth. What are you doing to the boy's mouth? Mommy, Daddy, I'm sorry I hurt you. I won't anymore. Can I have more pills? Yes, have all you want, son. Pills? You can't pills. swallow your way to happiness. You couldn't yes. even swallow yes. your way out of a bus station bathroom. What are these pills? Fiddling. Don't worry, they're spiritually based drugs. Look, recent science has discovered that for thousands of years, Tibetan monks used guttural prayer chants to soothe their yellow souls and the yellow face other yellow oppressors. But in our sophisticated world, who has time for that noise? You've got enough on your plate. Let Fiddlin' do the spiritual legwork for you. At Transcendental Medication, we sonically condense the biodharmic vibrations of over 1,000 monk chants into every pill. Science spiritific audiologists have found that vibration from a monk's throat doesn't radiate in megahertz, but in mega hearts. Come to Jamaica! If not now, when? If not it, what? If not things, stuff? Side effects include wet now, clad blood, frozen day rate, herniated monsterism, taint misbehavior, urethral screaming, global colostomy face, wrong body, restless lung syndrome, and sexual diarrhea. Do not wake the sleeping yellow dragon. Who says you can't find purity in a pill? Tune in to Fiddlin' with your soul. Oh no, my sacred mantra is being commodified. These Fiddlin' monks are being explat upon. They're being played like a fiddle. I'll stop that racket with my enlightened violins. Oh. The man is pointing in your face. Who are your bosses? Show yourselves, you cowards! We own the temple. We are our own bosses. So it's you, you rat. We are simple people, happy to share our love with all. Where I come from, sharing love without making a profit is called being a whore. And the working conditions here are horrifying. You've got to unionize to strike. Shut this place down until you give yourself the demands you desire. Buddha say material desire is poisonous. Then that union-busting tub of tards gonna find a boot up his ass. They're treating you monks like monkeys. Well, I say let's hurl our feces at them until they see us as men. We are content to visualize world peace. We'll visualize their shamefulizing with a giant inflatable union rot. Now we march. No justice, no chance, no justice, no chance. Why aren't you chanting? We prefer the sacred silence. Ooh, break them down with the silent treatment, eh? So devilish. It's clevelish. I can hear it working on you already. You hear that silence? Can you take it? The crushing blow of that fiery silence as it explodes in your ear with silence. <laughs> okay, we surrender if you get off your bike. Surely, indulging in a some small luxury will not lead to an infection of greed. You've gotten lazy and non-productive. You've taken Americans' job. How can we chat and eat at the same time? Let the machinge. Machinge? We made the Vibulator 2000. It does the grunt work of 3,000 monks. <laughs> then why didn't we call it the 4,000? No one knows. 
operating system she running? DOS X Machina? Which one of you Chinkanos kinked my machinge? It's an earthquake, a soul shake! My god, the Grand Canyon is closing up! Close your legs, Thank you for closing your legs, Mommy. How would you call this tremor? Pills? Open wide, time to take out the litter. Relieve your medicine. You've woken the yellow dragon. I've got to act now. This is the 9-11 of noise. The Chernobyl of Chante Hiroshima of Humping. The Nagasaki of Noki. The Dachau of Ouch, which is wet. I'm the three-mile island of going three miles off mass edge. And what a mess this is, edge. Yep, ah, skinning out of it. I told you I'd make you vibe together. You can't call me freak! What are you gonna do? Tell your mommy? Yes, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Mommy! Mommy! I have to tell you something. This wonderful family, they... Oh my god, it's just her meat. That means she's still alive out there. I'm going to search far and wide so that I can totally tattle to my mom.